Now, we need to write the numbers represented by these Roman numerals. So first, we have C, which is 100. Then, we have V, I, I. So that's 5, and then two ones, which is 7. So this number here is 107. Now, we have two C's, so that's 200. We have three X's, so that's three tens, which is 30. And we have a V and then an I, so that's five and then one, which is six. So putting that together, we have 236. Now we have C, C, so that's 200. We have X before L, so that's 10 before 50, which is 40. And we have I before V, so that's 1 before 5, which is 4. So our number is 244. Now we have three C's, so that's 300. We have L and then two X's, so 50 and then two tens, which makes 70. And we have V and then three I's, so five and then three ones, which make eight. So we have 378. Now we have three C's next to each other, so that's 300. And then we have an X before a C, so that's 10 before 100, which is 90. So our number is 390. Now we have C before D, so that's 100 before 500, which is 400. And we have I before X, so that's 1 before 10, which is 9. So our number is 409. Now C before D is 100 before 500, so that's 400. Then we have L, which is 50, and X, which is 10. So that's 60 altogether, which means we have 460. Now we have D which is 500. We have an L and then two X's, so that's 50 and two tens, which makes 70. And we have I, which is one, so that's 571. Now we have a D and then a C, so that's 500 and then 100, which makes 600. And we have two I's, so that's two ones, which means we have 602. Now we have D and then C, so 500 and then 100 makes 600. And we have two X's, so that's two tens or 20. Our number is 620. Now we have D and then two C's, so that's 500 and then two hundreds, which makes 700 altogether. We have L and then two X's, so that's 50 and two tens, which makes 70. And we have V and then two I's, so that's five and then two ones, which makes seven. So we have 777. Now we have D and then two C's, so 500 and then two more hundreds makes 700. Then we have X before C, so that's 10 before 100, which is 90. And I before X is 1 before 10, so that's 9. That means our number is 799. Now we have D, C, C, C. So that's 500 plus 3 more hundreds, which gives us 800. And we have 3 X's, so that's 3 tens, which is 30. So altogether, we have 830. Now we have C before M. So that's 100 before 1000, which is 900. We have L and then X, so that's 50 and then 10, which is 60. And we have I, which is 1, so that's 961. And finally, we have C before M, so that's 100 before 1000, which is 900. We have X before C, so that's 10 before 100, which is 90. And we have V and then I, so that's 5 and then 1, which is 6. 
So our number is 996.